When it comes to Jesus Christ and Alpha Getty, it's become a scenario where if I was on a cross, I would sing my ABCs. And with that being said, the following is the 19th alphabetized sin which needs addressing, being starving children. Just like everything leading up to this, we're talking about some issues that really need to be resolved. And knowing that there are children out there who can't eat breaks my heart even more than famine in itself. If I'm on that cross, I'll speak of starving children. I really want to soup up every single starving village. If I'm on that cross, I'm getting rid of hunger, particularly children, and you shouldn't have to wonder. If I'm on that cross, I'll speak of starving children. I really want to soup up every single starving village. If I'm on that cross, I'm getting rid of hunger, particularly children, and you shouldn't have to wonder. I know I've mentioned famine, but there's a little more. It really grinds my gears that children have to feel so poor. I wish that I could show up with an 18 wheeler truck and it would have enough to feed them since I know the times are rough. It's sad to see the little ones without a meal to eat. Well, there are those of us who always get a tasty treat. We can sponsor children or donate in abundance. However, it's as though we'd rather leave them in a dungeon. Missionaries tell them that the Lord hasn't forgotten. But what about the rest of us? We're failing more than often. Seeing starving children crowd around the bowl of rice should be enough to ruin every gluttonous appetite. I know we can do more and there's enough to go around, but as it stands, the world reacts like we just shouldn't hold them down. We wonder why we suffer, we're really all to blame, and all our agony is an extension of their pain. If I'm on that cross, I'll speak of starving children. I really want to soup up every single starving village. If I'm on that cross, I'm getting rid of hunger, particularly children, and you shouldn't have to wonder. If I'm on that cross, I speak of starving children. I really want to soup up every single starving village. If I'm on that cross, I'm getting rid of hunger, particularly children, and you shouldn't have to wonder. Famine is an issue, but I like to dabble deeper. The last thing that I want to act like is a shadow creature. It's time to help the kids. Let's do this hand to hand. The hourglass is almost running out of all its sand. The way that we ignore what's going on in third world countries might as well be taunting Dorothy with the witch's flying monkeys. The need the internet. Among the least of things, it's serviettes and napkins and some honey garlic rings. It's not as if it's everybody acting so neglectful, but the few who do a thing or two have barely been successful. Every day they struggle. Syrians, for instance. The country has been torn apart and we can make a difference. I told you long ago that Donald Trump should swap positions. Someone from the world can run the states and change the system. I guess nobody's gonna take me seriously though, until I dangle from a cross and I mysteriously go. If I'm on that cross, I'll speak of starving children. I really want to soup up every single starving village. If I'm on that cross, I'm getting rid of hunger, particularly children, and you shouldn't have to wonder. If I'm on that cross, I'll speak of starving children. I really want to soup up every single starving village. If I'm on that cross, I'm getting rid of hunger, particularly children, and you shouldn't have to wonder. If I'm on that cross, I'll speak of starving children. I really want to soup up every single starving village. If I'm on that cross, I'm getting rid of hunger, particularly children, and you shouldn't have to wonder. If I'm on that cross, I speak of starving children. I really want to soup up every single starving village. If I'm on that cross, I'm getting rid of hunger, particularly children, and you shouldn't have to wonder.